Zevi Barton and today we're taking a Sciencey Edge in the Technology Channel. We'll be looking at something different, something we don't always show. In fact, we're probably only going to show it once, but here it goes. Today, we're going to be reviewing the Celestron 114 Astromaster Telescope. Let's just... Here it is. I have used it about three or four times now. It's got an equatorial mount, so it's easy to use. Um, it's a re it's a reflector telescope, so it's short tube. It only comes in down, so it reflects off the bottom here. It bounces up into the tube here, and when you where you see see through. Sorry, seen from up here. Cap back on. It's got a German designed aluminium tripod, very strong. Uh, a tray here for your lenses and things like that. This is the counterbar light, so it easily moves around and you can see all of those. It's got a cap here, so you can see stuff. Um, I've seen so far in my three days of using it, uh, Jupiter, yeah, Jupiter, and I've seen rings on it. It wasn't very big, but you could see it. It, it, it was seeable. Um, I, I've seen obviously the moon. Um, I've seen Neptune, and I and I've seen Venus. So it, it, it's really cool. Um, I'll show you a few more things about it. Let me just bring you up. So as you can see here, you've got the RA and DCE to um, measure, you know, the longitude and latitude sort of thing. You've got the, you know, height and stuff like that. All the normal stuff. Uh, it, it's pretty easy to use. You've got slow motion controls, two of them. So there's that. There's the tray and the slow, slow motion stuff. But up here is a star pointer. And that isn't very good. It goes offline a bit. Um, on the back here, you have a camera piggyback. It doesn't take it through the telescope, so it doesn't see from up here. But it just takes a shot. And that that's about it. Uh, it costs two hundred and fifty dollars. It usually costs four hundred dollars. But I got it off a website called Ozscopes. If you're in Australia, it's a perfect place to go. Or if you're in America or some other site, um, uh, telescopes.com is a good place to go. So, this has been Xavier Barton with a review of the Celestron 114 Astromaster Telescope. See you around.